So when we want to analyze the content of an image, the second step we have to take, you say, is to do a semiotic analysis. Now that's a big word. What exactly does that entail? Yes, semiotics is a big word, and there's a massive body of literature on semiotics going back to the French philosopher Roland Barthes and, and the range of other kind of uh, writers. But ultimately, we can boil it down to a couple more straightforward propositions. Uh, in essence, semiotics is about analyzing the symbols that we see in an image. You know, we have to ask ourselves, what are these symbols standing for? Sometimes symbols are culturally specific, sometimes they're global, but they always refer to kind of similar types of symbols. So we have to ask ourselves, what is the political significance of the symbols we see in a particular kind of image? Okay, so if we take that back to our Boxing Day tsunami image, what are the questions that we try to answer when we do a semiotic analysis? So let's build on the compositional analysis and look again closer at this particular image. What kind of symbols, symbolic actions, symbolic gestures can we detect in the image you know, of the woman in there? But what's the symbol of, uh, that, that we see? The children, you know, what kind of symbols can we detect and what do they mean? How do they refer to kind of our previous knowledge of such symbols? 